testimony of what God has brought us out. How God has kept us. How God has preserved us. How God has healed us. How God has delivered us. In the face of insurmountable danger, God held us in the hollow of his hand. But we had nowhere to go. to what I'm saying. Yes. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so. That's not just a statement. It's an agreement. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. If God said it, only the redeemed of the Lord can say so. Yes, sir. Only then were blood washed, baptized in the spirit of living blood. If I shed out my head care, is able to say yes and yes. Not only did he say it, it's a sure. It's a fact. It's guaranteed. It's irreversible. Yes, it's unshakable. Lord. It's unchangeable. Oh my God in heaven. You need to begin to stand on the unadulterated yes. word of Almighty yes. God for everything you do. Hallelujah. 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 
Let's not just praise God for the good. Let's do some devil stomping for the bad. Come on, somebody. Uh, if you can shout for the good, you should shout twice as much for the bad. Somebody in here need to crack a hole through the kingdom of darkness. Yeah, you do. Somebody need to tell that demon to let go of your blessing. Somebody need to stop him from plaguing your mind, plaguing your heart, plaguing your body, plaguing your house, plaguing your kids, plaguing your condition. Somebody need to stand up and tell the devil what the word of God said. I'm going to get my speech to you. We have learned to hear without ever performing. That's right. We've learned that we can quote the word, but we're not quite sure if it's powerful enough to do what it's said it to do. Circumstances sometimes make you doubtful. Yes, it does. Come on, Pastor. Yes, it does, Bishop. Woo! I know that the morning Echadon has some friends. Yes, but Jesus is still the Lord of Lords. Yes, yes. 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 Hallelujah. Yes, we are his children. Yes, we are. I'm not presumptuous that we're the his children alone. There's somebody else out there playing. Yes, somebody else. But I can't speak for nobody else. I speak for my own experiences yes. in God. Yes. Like they don't have to speak for theirs. Yes. The same storm you see now is the same storm that's going on in some of your lives. See how you're preparing for this storm? Come on. See how you stay, you stay on the news, you stay things close to the news to find out what's going on, gather all the information you can. Well, then you need to do the same thing with the Word of God. And those kind of storms in our lives. That's right. When it's one of those perfect demonic storms. Yeah, yeah. It's coming in from the north and the south. Yes, when you can't tell whether it's a hurricane or a nor'easterner, yeah. right, you need to get a hold of God's holy word yes, right, and find out what directions you need to take right, to yes, prepare right, yourself not only to endure but to stand and outlast it. All right, yes. Because yes. God has given us power. Yes. I'm going to be in the book of Galatians for just a moment. One passage of scripture. Just one. Thank you, Jesus. Woo! Hallelujah. Yes, he is, Bishop. Yes. Thank you. If you're ever so humble, there's no place like home. I know that's right. Amen. You know, we can do a lot. I'm not a traveler. Never have I ever desired to be a traveler. And when I do travel, it's rare. Especially if I'm just going somewhere to show my face in the place. But many times I have, you see so many <clears throat> unusual things. Come on. <laughs> Not judging, just saying you see unusual things. And they should ask, oh, wow, so that's what we do. I'm a word broad person. Yes, I don't know anything but the Word of God and the moving of the Holy Spirit. How many know they got the Holy Spirit here today? Yes. Yes. Now I want you to be really sure about this. So usually we say that we, we immediately say. Yeah, we do. And sometimes when some of y'all do it because you'll be left out. Oh. <laughs> you don't want anybody to know you ain't got it at home. Come on. You ain't got it in the car where that mouth of yours is flapping. You ain't got it when that amen money didn't come in. You ain't got it when somebody shortchanged you in one of the stores. Oh, you ain't got it when you and your friend, mate, lover, or other, amen, is in a conflict. You ain't got. You say, kids, how many of y'all say? Raise those hands. <coughs> yes, sir. I was talking to one of our kids the other day. I said, you know, you're not too young to go straight to hell. Look at and they equate going to church as being saved. Well, yeah, Isn't that sad that we equate going to church as being saved? Mm -hmm. How many people we got Most in the church going to just go to church mm -hmm. and think they're saved? There's a yes. lot. There's a lot. There's a lot. One out of five. How many preachers that went and got their license because they went to church mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. thought they were saved? Mm -hmm. And had the ability to stir a crowd. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. 
ability to appear to have the knowledge of God's word throwing out of them without any of the inward graces operating. Come on. How many people have opened churches across the land and had no love for the sheep that God gave them? Wow. Because the Holy Spirit will not be abiding presence. How many of you have grew up in church environments and learned this and learned that as a child and thought you was okay growing up into an adult and never really gave your life to Jesus Christ? Right. Yeah. Sister, uh, I want you to, you know, christen the baby. I said, I can't. She said, why not? I said, because you ain't a man. $175. She said, a hundred what? I said, $175. I said, yeah, man. Bishop, I've been going to your church since I was five. I ain't got no paperwork that says member. That's right. There you go. Now, under mommy's regime, when you were, because you ain't right. declared that, that you are under our tutelage. That's right. See, I, people don't realize that. When, it, when you're growing up, you, you got open door policy. Mm -hmm. So everybody think you belong to that church. Right. These kids don't belong to the church, so I see a piece of paper. Mm -hmm. Amen. They're your kids. I don't think I'd rather say that to him. Right? Uh oh. Well, that's the truth. That is the truth, Pastor Dan. I, I can say that. Right now. Hold it, Pastor Dan. That, that's, that, that's my child. You're right. See, if they were the member in here, they're my child. That's right. That's the way the word goes. Go ahead, Pastor, because that's right. Amen. Well. So then, right now, they got open door policy. You know, the Pastor Dan's talking to my baby. I can talk to your babies. I can be there when they get a certain age. And, Pastor, you can't talk to my, my daughter. She just turned 18. She ain't listening. Nope. Can't say a word to her. I'm not her pastor. Help me out, Benji. That's right. That's order, Bishop. See, that, that's done, done, done decent in the spirit. See, you, you, before I get to my scripture, this is a freedom. You, are, you presume to yes, 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 yes. upon me as a pastor. I don't have the authority to govern your children until you give them to me. That's right. And that's only why they're young. When they get 18 years old, mm -hmm. I'm not their pastor. No, you're not. That's right. You see, as a parent, you miss that. You speak for your child until they're 18. That's right. Once they're 18, they'll tell you, excuse me, I can talk for myself. Mm -hmm. Yes, they can. Well, see, right now you're speaking for your child. So when you come to me and I have to talk to your children, I'm talking through your authority yes. of your allowance. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. When they're 18, I don't need, and they're a member, I don't need your allowance. They sure don't. Amen. Amen. I can talk to them point blank. Yes, you can. I don't yeah. hurt your feelings. I can talk to them point blank that's and the get truth. the issue settled. Yes, that's the yes. truth, Pastor. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, I do. Yes. 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 Amen. Sometimes brothers and men go to church because they're wise go to church. Mm -hmm. I gotta say you. Mm -hmm. You gotta counsel my husband. I can't. <laughs> say to him. You gotta be the pastor. He ain't a member. That's right. You gotta be part of that whatever vineyard you're yes. in, you gotta be part of that vineyard yes. to receive the privileges yes. Yes, sir. and the discipline right. of that vineyard. Yes. Shepherd! That's the reason why if you go to the church, they have to release you. Yes, they do. Amen. Oh, yes, hear that they do. They See, if you go to a church and never got released, you're you're fraudulent. Yes, you are. Amen. 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 That's the game. That's the way it You works. know why you're fraudulent? Because that I'll be superseding another person's authority over you. That's yeah. right. Yes. Amen, Pastor. Yes, Bishop. And if they really want to get technical about that matter, especially they got a seal mm -hmm. membership yes. certificate yes. that's made of a legal document. Yes, it is. Uh huh. You are right. You can okay. say that. Yes. You want to get the record so y'all understand that. That's right. They don't got to grow because. <laughs> That means I gotta, they gotta con I gotta contact them to see what your condition was. Mm -hmm. You have that right. right. You have that right. I can ask them what you were there. That's right. Yeah. Yes, you can. <laughs> you have that right, bitch. See, the reason why you don't want to do that is because I'm gonna find out some truth. Yes, you are. Absolutely. Maybe he wasn't the abused one there. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. If you leave here without a releasement, you're sitting in another church fraudulent. Yes, you are. Oh, I didn't get a phone call from no preachers. All right. Your name is still on membership, saying Amen. you remember. Amen. I ain't said I don't live with nobody. Amen. <laughs> Go ahead, Pastor. You talk They're to using me. one of my members. Yes, they are. <laughs> <laughs> right? Woo. Yes. I'm going to go to 
description, brother, go to where you say But it's a, some things that need to be said because we don't always understand. So when I did speak to that to the two young lady, they were highly offended and I don't think the mother cared for it, but I can tell the mother that ain't none of your business. Amen. I'm talking to a grown woman. That's <laughs> right. Amen. Yeah, so she has to make her mind what she wants to do. That's right? true. Amen. That's that that's the bottom line. Amen. Amen. Galatians chapter five. Praise God. Hallelujah. We are definitely living in a time where everything is really loose. Very. We are not as pillarized mm -hmm. as we should be in our faith, in our steadfastness. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Things shake us too quickly. Words uproot us too swiftly. Yes. Yes. Conditions yes. cause us to move. Yes. Amen. I hate a guy without getting any permission from God. Mm -hmm. yes. yeah. And in doing so, we find ourselves out there in an open sea of despair, trying to figure out how we got there. And after a period of time, you become driftwood, mm -hmm. just drifting along. Mm -hmm. You drift from one situation to another. To another. Yes. You drift from one problem to another. One. Concern to another. Pretty soon, you're, you're, you're what is called problems. Mm -hmm. Because that's all you deal with. Is pro you have problems all the time. All the time. Go ahead, Pastor. I don't think anybody in the world got problems every day, all day, all day life. There's got to be some time in there where you ain't got a problem somewhere. Yeah, There's a time that you laughed. Somewhere. Even if you laughed at somebody, yeah. you laughed. Yeah. <laughs> There are times when you have, you have some comfort. You had always been working for 24 hours straight like a mule. Some days you had your feet propped up and called out. Yes, man. Yes, that's right. You ain't always been hungry because you got too much weight on you. Tell the truth, Pastor. Amen. 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 Yeah, every time I hear you, oh, uh, I ate in four days. That's not possible. Because you're telling me that every week. <laughs> You should look like a man Popeye's girlfriend. Olive oil. <laughs> but y'all look like a robust. <laughs> you have to tell me you got a pain, an ache, somewhere. Does the body has the body been hurt since you've been born? Wow, Pastor. Wow. It wasn't hurt when you was running for that check. All right. Yeah. It didn't hurt when you was chasing that sister or that brother. Amen. It really didn't hurt when all things okay. Right. It's a hurting worse when you ain't getting nothing. Mm. The same when you don't get what you want, your body goes through convulsions. Okay. Right. <laughs> Amen. And it's making us kind of quivering as the people of God. The devil comes in and he easily sways us from our, our arena of peace and comfort and contentment to worry and anguish and upset, being upset. How many people know you're upset most of the time? Mm -hmm. And don't even really know it. You think you're upset over a problem, but you're like that when it is no problem, just waiting to come out. Yeah. Wow. So you couldn't get upset if upset wasn't already part of who you are. Yes, right. Right. Yes, you couldn't. You could not be a worrier if worrier was not worrying was not already a part of your yeah. mental condition. That's true, Pastor. Yeah. You were conditioning, you was conditioned to worry. Somebody conditioned you to worry. Mm. You worry about stuff that ain't happened yet. Come on, Pastor. You worry about stuff that happened next year and you ain't lived there yet. Days, amen, October, you already got January all in your mind. You are planning, you're planning next year's vacation and hope you can get it. You ain't got the one you had this year yet. We are perpetual worriers about something, and yet the Bible clearly defines that worry is sin. Because worry is doubting the validity of God's word. Maybe you're worrying because you have no time in God's word. Maybe you're worried because you and God don't have no relationship, amen, that has given you the ability to believe and trust that God can't lie. Come on, Pastor. 
How often do we let things suddenly shake our world? Just something simple, shake our world. Your mother-in-law is coming. Whoa, oh, man. <laughs> the, oh, not the day off. Oh, please, please, please. The, and we begin to act the way. Why? Because that mother-in-law likes their condition the way they want their yes. condition. So you have to live up to the specs. Yes. You, that would never happen if you was, wasn't overly concerned about your mother-in-law because you didn't marry them. Amen. 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 That's right. That's right. <laughs> If, 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 if the woman or the man did it right, they don't let them two go already. Yes. Come on. That's right. the word. Yes. Amen. Bible tells me clearly when a man finds a woman. Yeah. Imagine when they have to clarify that fine, because y'all looking too hard for me. I <laughs> You can't see your own pumpkin patch but look at the word across the street. I, Got a nice big pumpkin sitting right there. That guy got a pumpkin that ain't right yet, and you want his. Lord, have mercy. Have mercy. But I'll just find that in another day. Lord, have mercy. It's the truth. It didn't mean go through several of them until you find the one you want. Stop, stop squeezing the melons if you ain't buying it. Come on, Pastor, make that plan. If you walk by smelling all the cantaloupes, he was one of the sweetest. Oh. Get your nose off the cantaloupes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. And that, then you will leave your fingerprints on all of them in the church. <laughs> and then you don't want none of them. There's something wrong with you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that don't feeling pretty good because you're feeling it. All interested? I mean, you go buy a melon from the other part of town. Uh, if I was that miller, I'd smack you too. <laughs> Sir, finding a wife don't mean that means you out there searching every female. Amen. Y'all you know, searching? After you finish talking about marriage, you talk about sex. My God. How you feel about this? I don't feel nothing now about it. Godly people find out godly qualities first. Yes, sir. Yes. All right. Amen. Godly people find out godly qualities first. Thank you, Benji. I appreciate that. <laughs> we have begun to lose our ability to stand on these type of principles. So now we're a bunch of people that is, we pray a lot because we worry a lot. We're not praying because we're communicating with the Father. We're praying due to our worry and our stress, our over-concerned, our surcharging our hearts, or the Bible says, so fretting our hearts. We're, we're fretting about this and we're fretting about that and this is the adjutant and y'all don't understand what I'm going through and nobody knows the troubles I see. All I can say is give me a break. Amen. Because scripturally speaking, nothing that you're going through has not been commonly, yes. amen, yes. manifested yes. Yes. in the body of Christ yes. in the first place. Yes. You're not going through anything new. It's nothing, amen, brand new. Somebody went through it before you got here. Yes. Yes. Somebody went through it while you was here. Somebody going through it while you're sitting here. Yes. Yes. So you're not really going through anything so devastating in life that, oh my God, the world comes to an end. You're just going through your portion of trouble like anyone else. Go through their portion of trouble. Whether you're saved or not, you're going to have some troubles in your life. Troubles is a part of living. Tribulation is a part of living. Some you cause yourself and some other people cause you. You've got to be wise to know the difference. Yes, sir. Well, that, that devil ain't always a devil. Yeah. Some of this stuff you put your own self into. Yes, because you make poor decisions outside of God. Yes, when his word said, in all thy ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct thy path. Yes. Maybe I need to say it again, but he made the quotation of turn. It's a quotation of life. Yes, yes. Yeah. Acknowledge, recognize God in all your endeavors. Yes. From the matter maximum to the minimum. Right. And he will. He will. Not your mammy. That's right. Not your daddy. That's right, Pastor. Don't ask your kids what you should do. They ain't even going to know yet. That's right, Pastor. 
He shall. He shall. He who he died shall direct thy pathway. Sometimes you can't hear him because what you want is greater than what he's saying. That's the truth. So you, what you do is veto it. Wow. I know what you said, God, but I'm vetoing it. Yeah. Because this is where I think it should go. Well, God is a perfect gentleman. Go ahead. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. He'll let you. I'll hear you in about 15 days. Yes, you will. He will let you. Yes, he will. It'll take long. Yes, Lord. We're living in a state of unrest. When the Bible told us that we should have a state of ease. Yes, yes, yes. The Bible said again that he has not given us a spirit of fear. I know I'm in the word here. But he has not given us a spirit of fear. Did you hear what I said? He, the Father, he, the Son, he, the Holy Ghost, has not given unto us a spirit of nervousness. Shaky. Quaky. Had again, is the earth being out for long? Let's keep preaching. Uh -huh. Oh my God, a volcano just grew up, amen, out the ocean. Well, keep preaching till something hit us, so God takes it home. Go ahead. I can't, I just can't pray anymore. Why? Because you're too scared to pray. Uh -huh. But see, you don't think it's fear. You know what? Because you're praying about what you're scared of. Yeah. Uh -huh. All right. I'm going to get to my scripture in a moment. I'll get you home early enough so y'all can get locked in. We're fearful about things that other people say. How can someone else make you shake across town? Can you imagine that? They went across town, living so, and all they got to do is say, I've become deceived. Did they? That's little kid stuff. <laughs> This little kid said, we're going to get you outside. And you shake all day. <laughs> Man, you shake up a storm. Get outside. One punch and the fight's over. <laughs> you know why? Because that first punch hit you, you don't feel anything after that. <laughs> you went blank and all you know is it was hair flying, punching, biting, scratching, kicking, yelling, talking about their mother and cussing them out. <laughs> Somebody's going to break you. <laughs> Don't even know you got punched, don't feel a thing. If you ain't got knocked out, you ain't lose. <laughs> there is a, a true no statement that if you're going to fight, I don't mind losing. But I'm the other guy that know he was in a fight. So when you go home, you still be pretty. So I said, well, what happened to you? Oh, I had to beat the guy. <laughs> you get the best of you, too. So that's a good fight. If you get beat up and uh, they never got hit you with a punk. Scratch them, but I'm trying to tell you something. Well, here we are fighting the devil, and the devil's beating us up. He ain't got a mark on him. He came in pretty, beat you up, and held out pretty. <laughs> he was dressed well when he kicked your butt. But if you had got down to business with Jesus, somebody has been freeing with some wounds. You hear the devil howling trying to get away from him. Why? The reason why you're no longer standing fast right. in the things that God has taught you since you learned them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what it says. It stand fast, therefore, first verse, in the liberties wherewith Christ has made us free. Yeah. Yes. Comma, and be not entangled yeah. again with the yoke of bondage. Yeah. Yeah. Did you hear the word? Jesus, yes. Stand fast. Mm. Woo. Thank you, Jesus. My mother used to tell me, shake on the inside, but never on the outside. Amen. Look him in the eye and look like he was. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now you can be shaking, but he'll never know it. Right. People that don't shake make other people nervous. Mm -hmm. Never let the devil know what you're doing. Don't let his people know you scared. Amen. Stop speaking fear in your conversation. 
Stop talking nervousness when God has not given you a spirit of fear. Yes. He has not given you a trembling, nervous, shaky, jelly back quiver. I don't say you don't feel it, but he didn't give it to you. Yes. That's right. I don't say you don't get nervous, but you didn't give your nervousness. That's your human quality. Uh -huh. Becoming afraid of the unknown. Uh -huh. Becoming nervous about what it can't figure out. Yeah. It becomes uncertain about what it can't, amen, dissect in its mental, amen, intuition. But God said, I'm not giving you, I'm giving you the spirit of power. Yes. Uh -huh. The ability to stand fast in the midst of the most horrendous storms that life can bring about. I've given you my power. My power makes you rooted, steadfast, unmovable. I'm not turning my back. I'm not finding a hole to put my head in. I'm not running down a dark alleyway. If we gonna do it, we gonna do it right here. All right. I have the power to withstand and to endure. I have the power to overcome once I stand and endure. Yes. When the smoke clears, I'm still standing Hallelujah. with yes. praise in my mouth, Hallelujah. joy in my heart, Hallelujah. faith in my confidence. Hallelujah. No matter what the outcome is, I'm yet standing. Yes. Hallelujah, Jesus. Yes, yes. And when you've done all to stand, stand ye therefore, yes. Ephesians, mm -hmm. having your loins girded about yes. with the belt of truth. Come on, see, truth. Yes. Not the philosopher's truth. Right. Not the religiosity's truth. Sorry, parents, not your truth. Mm -hmm. Not how your grandmother seen it. Whoo, God help us this morning. But how God has said it, God's word has already declared that heaven and earth shall pass away. But his word, his word, shall never pass. He didn't ask you to feel it, he asked you to believe it. Amen. Yes. Yes. We forgot he's always been a way maker. Mm -hmm. That's right. Always. A preserver. Yes. Always. He has kept us in uncomfortable times. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. In diverse manners. Yes. Yes. He has looked favorably upon us when we've been wrong. Yes. Yes. His grace yes. still abided with us. Yes. When we were in destitution, he made sure the birds fed us with some bread. And it was a stream where we could get a little something to drink every now and then. We may not have had the king's table, the banquet of the princess, uh -huh. but we didn't go hungry. No, we did no. not. No, we did. Hallelujah. We may not have lived in the palace with satin sheets, All right, Bishop. but I, I found me a cot. Yes. I said I didn't lay my head on the ground. All right. God All right. made a way for us. Yes. God has always made a way. For his children. One way or another. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Therefore, in knowing that I have the freedom. Yes, sir. The liberty. Yes, sir. To relax. Yes. Thank you, Lord Jesus. And trust the sovereignty yes. of the King of Kings. Yes, yes, Lord. Hallelujah. I don't plan on the holiday today. I'm gonna get this straight. All right, you preach it, sir. Why we a man frizzled up, getting happy over stuff that don't mean deadly or the squat? I suggest that we go back to standing mm -hmm. on the immovable word of God. Yes. That in spite of how it may feel, yes. in spite of what it may appear to be, yes. and I hate to say it, in spite of what everybody else in church is saying, right, you stand on the principles. That is unshakable through God. Yes. If God has declared He would, yes. I don't care how thin the wire is. Yes. I don't care how loose, how, how narrow the margin of time may be. If God has to, He'll suspend time yes. just for you, yes. just so He can work out. 
made us free. Yes. yes. Thank you, Lord Jesus. That's the game. The, the, the line is getting short. Then let the line be cut. Mm -hmm. And see what God still can do. Amen. Uh, yeah. We had that. It's a, it's a little thing. We said, you know, God, he's, a, he's an all time God. Yes, yes he is. But see, you forgot, time don't mean nothing to God. Time will be from you. Uh -huh. You're stressing at dates and clocks. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Come on, Pastor. Time does not mean anything to God. Yes, sir. Now, you ought to think God has already proved your faith out. That your faith is based on the 24 hour system, the date system, and the year system. Come on, Pastor. And then you have those, amen, they're trying to be helpful. Don't worry, baby, God's on time. God ain't never late. God won't be there, amen. But sometimes God says, no, I'm not. Mm -hmm. He said, I'm not going to be there for a reason. I want the enemy to rage. All right, come on. Come on. Oh, God, oh, God. I want him to get stirred up in somebody. Oh, for a reason. It's a reason. I want you to confront your adversary face to face with nothing to say. Yes. Uh -oh. Purpose. Oh, Purpose. Oh, help me, Lord. Mm. Purpose. Yes, Father. Okay, you're going to get a little quiet now. It's all right. It's all right. So you got the other part of the gospel. Uh. I beat the devil running, amen. Mm. Ain't no running today. None. If he wanted, he had to take it out of my dead cold hands. Oh, yes. <laughs> But this faith I fought for. Yes, yes sir. Yes. I've gone through for. Yes, sir. I've tried and agonized for. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. For this faith, I wasn't liked. Yes. For this faith, people shunned me. Yes, they did. For this faith, family left me. Yes, they have. For this faith, saints didn't want to be bothered with me. Come on, that's the truth. Oh, Lord Jesus. Yes, Lord Jesus. And I stood fearless. Because he has not given me the spirit of fear. Right. But he went on to say, but of power. P, capital P for me. Yes. Capital O. Capital W. Yes. Capital E. Uh -huh. Capital R. Uh -huh. It started out in the lower cases, but as I walked in it. All right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. As I faced the trials of life. As I face the accusations and the contradictions yes, sir. and the no's, and I, that should have been a yes. Yeah. Glory to God. When I face the possibilities of remaining homeless. Come on, remaining that way. Yes, sir. When I face the possibilities of being lied on and yeah. lost several of my jobs. All right. When I face a man being charged as a thief. Because the one I was with was the thief. Come oh, on. Oh, God. Yes, yes. Come on. When you face the problem of sickness, mm. disease, yes. destitution, yes. rejection, yes. loneliness, yes. Woo, bah, yeah, yeah. Yes. yes, Lord. In the midst of what you face, God is exercising Hallelujah. a muscle inside your mortal body. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Brother, you turn it off for me so they ah, stay warm and I can cool Jesus. off. Jesus, thank you. But then what I said, and of love. Oh. Oh, here And of love. Yes, Pastor. So my liberty has something to do with my love. Yes, it does. My liberty has something to do with my love. Yes, Pastor. Because love means I trust somebody. <laughs> love means I'm depending on somebody. See, love can't be can't operate until you have something to show it to. Yes, sir. That's it. In the, in the, in the mid 1970s, there was a little item out of the market called My Pet Rock. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. It's a yes. pet rock. Yes, sir. I remember those. Who in the world? <laughs> I bought one. But there were people buying, they really dressed up these little rocks. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. And they tried to get it. It don't poop, it don't pee, you ain't got to yeah. feed it. 
<laughs> and they, they just petted us. In my mind, either you're retarded. Okay. <laughs> or just plain old say. You got, little, you got little designs on the pet. Yeah. You can buy more than one pet and get mad at somebody tell me, watch out, don't sit there, my pet's there. What? It's a rock. Somebody skip across the park. I said, said this, that's our problem now. Yes, sir. We want a faith that doesn't live. We want a faith that just sits there. Rock solid. No, mama, just a pet. <laughs> In the test enough of this. Jesus. A breeze comes through and dirt moves. Yes, it does. Sand moves. Sand is nothing but crushed pebbles. Yes, it is. You ever get sand in your mouth and hear how it grits against your teeth? Those are little rocks. You're hitting it anymore with a, a pet sand piece. Petting them. You know this. Jesus didn't say if you had this, the faith of a, of a grain of sand. But faith has to be developed. And it cannot be developed until you have something worth believing about. Amen. I didn't say believing in. I said believing about. It's easy to believe in Jesus. Yes, it is. Jesus, it is. Once you be with her, oh, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, God, I'm so glad I'm saying, Oh, you the wonder. Hallelujah. But see, trouble comes. Yes, it does. Jesus is sitting on the right hand of the Father. Yes. Speak this, Pastor. He ain't coming down here talking, What's up? All right. He sent you two things the Word of God, Word of God yes. and the Holy Ghost. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. Yes. But you can't get the Holy Ghost the word. until you get some word. Amen. Because the Spirit of God is already declared in the Word of God through Jesus that He would lead you and guide you where again? Where do you think the truth is at? In the Word. In the Word. Yes. Just try to help me. Some of our, our liberties have gotten distorted because we don't believe like we used to believe. I would I, 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 I listen to some of how, how the, 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 the apostle pastor's wife stood up and, and gave words of encouragement. I thought to myself, wow, that, those are years. years. Those are years. But I had to wonder how many people was dancing because it felt good. And how many people was dancing because they have been through? Oh, God, yes. See, the one thing, the one thing to dance is you caught up in the excitement of the moment. Mm -hmm. It is. But when you can identify to what that person is talking Talk about, about, when you can look back in your life and see the hard yes. times and the rough yes. conditions and the situation that was outside yes. of the joy, and watch how God oh, you yeah, you yeah. Now you got some faith. You got some work yes, talking sir. about.
outside the hospital. He's on deathbed in the hospital. The family has gathered. And God spoke a word over a telephone. You hear me say, Pastor Daniel, I say, God. Her brain should have been mush. Yes, 
See, oh, you got testimony. That's right. I don't know what's wrong with you. Hallelujah. Yes. I'm sitting beside her bed on the days I got there. She's cut. She didn't touch me. She touched the Bible in her in her in her in her comatose state. She got her hands wrapped around the Word of God because that's what she's been taught since she never tasted. That's right. That's Five days later, they took the tube out of her, and she came right back to life. She was well. Yes. No brain damage. None. No deterioration of the law. That's God. That's God. That is God. Don't tell me you ain't got some faith somewhere in here. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. And yet, when it comes time to dig up your praise, Peter, the first chapter, the first Peter, God, and I 
says, who resists the fast in the faith. Tell me, give me verse 8. I'm going to have verse 8 and verse 9. Help me read this. Come on, quick, 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 quick. 1 Peter 5, 8, and 9. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, as a roaring lion, walketh about. Did you just hear what that sister said to you? I want you to hear it carefully. I want you not to just listen to the quotation of a scripture. I want you to listen to what the Spirit of God has said through the penitent of Apostle Peter. I want you to pay close attention to what he told you not to do. Hallelujah. Read it again. Be sober. Be sound-minded. Be vigilant. Be on guard. Because your adversary, the devil. Because you got an enemy that's always waiting to destroy you. As a roaring lion. Oh, come on. He's fierce. He's savage. He's merciless. Walk at the back. Seeking whom he may devour. He's always roaming. He roams in your neighbor. He roams in your boss. He roams in some of you say sitting in church. He roams in your kids. He roams, amen, in departments that need to help you. He's always looking for the opportunity to savagely and fiercely destroy you. Who resist steadfast in oh, the faith. Oh, wait a minute. Steadfast in what? In the faith. In the faith. Sister, somebody tell me what the language of faith is. Praise! Hallelujah! Glory to God! I heard you coming. I'm going to hear from my people. Thank you. What is the language of faith? Not today, don't. That's right. 
because the enemy got a hold of their mind. Yes, sir. They might be sorry tomorrow. Uh -huh. But their adversary and yours slipped around them, lurking in their crevices of their minds. Yes, sir. That's waiting right. for the opportunity for you to come out of the spirit. Mm -hmm. To move out of the word of God. Yes. To move yourself from prayer. To, mm -hmm. to get out of the praises that God put in you yes. so he can operate in your thought system and make you act outside of God's will to do harm to somebody else. Outside of the will of God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Ariana one time asked Ariana, why did you do that? The child was so dead, I was I couldn't even do anything with her. The devil, the devil got in my mind and made me do it. She told the truth. He spoke to her mind and she did her wrong. He's speaking to your mind and you're sitting here wrong. My God. Speak it. Yes, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. I'm almost through. Thank you, Jesus. I love the Lord, my God. Thank you, Jesus. 1 Corinthians 15 and 58 says, Therefore, my beloved brother, be ye steadfast, come on, move Yes, sir. Come on. I, I didn't want to understand what you were saying, unmovable. Unmovable means I'm not budging off of what I believe. Mm -hmm. Guess what? When you still believe it, <coughs> you still shout. <coughs> That's right. That's the truth. When you still believe it, you still can dance. Yes, I can. Amen, Pastor. That's right. Yes, she can. When you are unmovable, because you still believe what God said, and the joy of the Lord has become your strength. Yes, it has. The God of your salvation is your supporter. Yes. See, I know when you don't got it because you become un you become movable. Unmovable, you can't shake me in spite of what you show me. Hey. God, thank you. I want you to understand what I just said. If you think it's a great mystery, it's not. I learned mm -hmm. yeah. that you can't shake me <laughs> because I'm going to move on what I believe concerning the Lord Jesus Christ, God the Father, God the Spirit. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. I believe the unadulterated word of God in spite of how many of us mess it up, including myself. All right. Yes, Bishop. You have not understood the word unmovable. It doesn't mean, amen, that your body doesn't move. It means your heart stands yes. fast. Yes. Jesus! Oh, yes. Hallelujah! Hey. Yes. Thank you, Father. Heart's the seat of my emotions. Yes. My mind is rooted and grounded. Yes. I gotta give him praise no matter what it looks like. Yes. 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 You see, our mind is trained that if you give him praise, that God's gonna look out. My mind is saying, yes, he don't work it out. Off the scriptures out of day by Meshach, Shadrach, and Abednego. But we have still missed the point. The point was not that they were delivered. The point was they would rather die than to change what they believed. And they were bold enough to tell the enemy to his face. See, why you shaking? You ain't said nothing to Satan yet. That's why your back still hurt. He's cracking it for you. Oh, shut That's why he can't give you my brain. Jesus. He's using the hammer to bang against your temporal oh, world. Right, Thank you, Jesus. Woo! That's why your heart, amen, oh, skips so many beats. Because he's squeezing oh. with fear. Thank you, Jesus. They faced their demons. Thank you, Jesus. And the king of their demons. Oh, yes, and told him, yes, we know that God is able. So you're afraid to say that because he might not. I'm not afraid to say that. Because if he don't, it doesn't make a difference. It doesn't make a difference. Come on, Pastor. Thank you. But what he said, we know that God is able. He can. But if he don't, I'm still not moving. See, sometimes, you know what I'm saying? God's trying to get some of y'all right there. So you're not there yet. He's trying to get you there. Thank 
what you used to depend on. That's right, that's right. One day, you can't go where you used to go to get what you used to get. That's true. And God said, I built you up. I'm weaning you now. I let you be my second baby for a little while, but now it's time to get off the grass. It's time to see, show me what you really made out of. I put my enzymes inside of you. You got my vitamin out of my chest in your belly. I'm your strength, I'm your power, I'm your might. Now I wanna see what you can do by yourself. I wanna see if you'll stand by yourself. Will you trust in what you know? Will you trust in what I've done? Will you trust in what I said? Will you trust in how I brought you? Will you trust in how I kept you? Will you trust in how I maintained you? I'm gonna let you stand by yourself for a little Jesus! Glory to your name, Lord Jesus. And like every good parent, he's not too far.
but for you. Hallelujah. He bit and we die daily. Yes. We cease to exist. Yes. We can't have our way. Yes. We can't do what we want to do. Yes. We can't say what we want to say. Yes. But we need to die so you can live. Yes. But we receive the revelation yes. and deliver to you yes. that life will be soon in you. Unto their own destruction. Wait, again? Unto their own destruction. See, I'm trying to tell you something. You don't get away. No, we don't. They're not going to get away. They're trying to deceive you. No, they they don't. Even the devil's not going to get away because there's a place prepared specifically right. for him. Hallelujah. Read some more. Go ahead. Be therefore, beloved, seeing ye know these things Thank before. Jesus. Stop. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Therefore, beloved, seeing. How many say think I'm saying something new here today? No. 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 You know why you get excited? Because you feel the power of the word of God that I'm speaking through the That's Holy right. Spirit. But it was spoken to you before. Yes. And you read it before. Yes. You looked upon it before. Yes. You heard it at one point in time or yes. nothing. Yes. But this might be the day that your heart's open enough to hear a new revelation. Right. You understand that it's been imparted to you. Right. That you don't go back the road you've been going down. Yes. That you can seal off the door of the yesterdays and walk into your door yes. today yes. and see the magnanimous power of Almighty God operating in the force yes. of your body. Yes, yes. Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, please, I'm sorry, we don't. Seeing ye know these things before, mm -hmm. beware lest ye also, oh, being God. led away with the error of the wicked, Ooh. fall from your own steadfast. Man, be yes. careful. Yes. Watch out for the lying tongue, yes. the deceitful manners, them. then they don't believe the word the way you were taught to believe the word. Then they don't see the word in the light of the Spirit of God, how he gave it to you. Beware. Beware. Yes. Because he's coming after your faith. Yes. And the only way to get your faith is the way you got faith. Yes. And faith came by hearing. Here. And hearing by the word of God. Well, he's using the reverse. And faith is taken away by hearing. Mm -hmm. By hearing the God of this world. That's right. That's right. If it changed, they ain't the right person. It's not. I've been wondering since I was two, I could care less if they birthed you out the womb. Huh? When it comes to the word of God, yes. God's word is right yes. there in the yes. top of the yes. 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 Hallelujah. Yes. I'm trying to tell you something. He said, I don't want you to fall from your stuff fastest. It's going to be your stuff fastest, Brother Jared. It's going to get you into glory. Because you maintained it when everybody else was against it. When you held on to it, when everybody else called it wrong to you didn't back up when everybody said that's, that's too hard. Yes, that's not how Christianity works. Yes. And you need to lay back and chill. Yes. I don't want to chill. I want to be hot and on fire. I want to stand in the word of God unmovable. I want to shake a break. I don't need to do what you can do. I don't want to do it. Because I'm saving myself. I'm an antique. I'm a dinosaur. I'm part of the ancient of days. I belong to the beginning. I'm standing in the middle. They will see me at the end. I'm all of that and some more, my God. You can call me what you want, but call me one more thing. Start fast. I am the liberty that was once delivered unto me. I contended for the faith that's been delivered to the saints of God. And I got to keep standing. It just shy won't come again. Yes, oh, God, I'm yes, yes, I'm still fast. Yes, I'm unmovable. Yes, I'm terrorized. Yes, I'm honorized. Yes, Thank you, Lord Jesus. 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 Thank you, Jesus. My God. Sometimes we have God. Why? Why? If I tell you now, you won't go through. I'll tell you when you're almost at the end. Oh, my Savior. Oh, my Savior. Yes, yes. 
If I tell you too soon, you're going to move too quick. Help me, God. Yes, you will. If I tell you in the beginning, you're going to be too foolish and you're going to mess up. Right. If I tell you in the middle, you're going to be too overly concerned and won't do nothing. All right. I'm going to tell you near the end, when you've been seasoned a little bit, when what you've been going through has rubbed you the wrong way, oh, yes. when the sandpaper trial has sanded down your knot hole on the wood, when you have lost that rough edge that you've been enjoying for a long time, when I bring your mind to a place where you can't go to your friends, you can't go to your family, Right. And nobody's going to give you an answer. That's if they right. had the answer, they're not going to give it to you. Because I got a spike in their tongue. Uh, they're not going to say a word to you. Because I need you to get to a certain point or a certain place at a certain time for a certain reason. All right. Jesus. Hallelujah. Jesus. Yes. Yes. And when you're almost there, no, I'll give you a part of the answer. No. Almost there, part of the answer. Because the second part will come by the experience. Yes. Oh, my, oh, my. Oh, my. You're going through the anguish. Yes. You're going through anguish because you don't believe. That's right. Yes, sir. You're not going to anguish because the devil did it. You're yeah. going to anguish because you didn't believe what I've been telling you for the last seven years. That's right. The last two years. Okay. The last one year. Yeah. The last one month. I just told you the same thing last month. You didn't believe me. That's right. Come on. Oh. Anguish. And see, and even in that, you still don't see how, how, how simple you are. If I told you the same thing last month, what's so difficult believing about this month? Mm -hmm. Lord, help me. Oh, see, now you're quiet again. It's all right. It's still the truth. Yeah. It's the same enemy attacking you. He, same. he didn't change his face. He's the same enemy. Hallelujah. And yet you'll testify that I'm the Lord thy God. Yes, we will You'll say. praise my name. Yes, sir. You'll leap around the floor. Yes, sir. Lying. Yes, sir. It's a lie. Yes. Because inside you know that when the service is over, mm -hmm. you still gotta face the same thing you face getting. That's right. Say that, Pastor. So how did you praise me and still stay in the same condition? Mm -hmm. Unless you did it and then let me do it in you. That's it. That is the truth right there. Yes, it is. I've been there. You know what I found out? In, in any, any assembly of people, oh, yeah, glory. everybody that leap up is not leap up because they believe. Oh, yeah. Some of them because they've been so long they expect to leap. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. So sad. Yeah. See, right at the minute, if I didn't even mention people only feet walk out of that house right now. You know what you're talking about? You used to this kind of meal, so don't mean it. We were brought up on good food, good food, good table, good yeah. 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 See, I might not find me a starving congregation. Yes, sir. Hey, yeah. Somebody who want what I got. Yeah. Somebody who's still hungry inside yeah. 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 and spilled this tape before them and watched them receive what you should have got. Oh. Watch oh. them get what you should have had. Oh. Your heart is fixed. 
Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah.
steadfast to give God a chance. Yes. China's my baby. Yes. Hey, one of you don't know that. That's my sugar. Yes. You want to get a real argument yes. between me and China? Uh, I'm telling you, it's going to be a problem. Yes, a problem. I'll start with mother. Yes, <laughs> no, that's the truth. Yes, it will. But I want you to understand something. <coughs> I want you to understand something. For years, we looked at China and just sucked our teeth. Yeah. Oh, my God. She's a Gucci mama and dog. She this and she that, she this and she that. But guess what? She got more praise than some of us in here. I know this. <laughs> she stepped in the church and all these skepticisms. All right. But you say, step out in the house, sis. Step out in the house. See, I, I don't see, amen, cleavage going down her knees no more. All right. She's amen. She's changing a great, a great yes. she she is God the same person. She's been stood fast yes. in yes. spite of public opinion. Yes. Pamela, we got to be stood fast. Yes. Because yes. what God has for us yes. will not be lost in the dust. All right now. If God got to reach down to the bowels of heaven and pull up for you, he'll yes. bring it to you because that's what he's ordained All right. for you to yes. be.